I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am not able to serve in this jury. Because I am a clairvoyant, Your Honor. A <laughs> Listen, I can assure you, I take my civic duties very responsibly. That's why it would be almost impossible for me to be fair or impartial as a juror. Because I do care. No. Okay. <laughs> you see. All I need to do is have a look at any of the evidence presented and get a full picture of where it's been, who's handled it. Oh, and if I was to touch any of the evidence presented, I mean, <laughs> it's gonna just open another can of worms, you know what I mean? Like the things that the police didn't find or the things that the police don't want anyone to see, you know what I mean? And all for what? By then I already know what the verdict will be. Okay, listen, I know what you're thinking. If this is true, why don't I work for the police and go catch some killers? Well, I wish I could, but I can't because I have uh, another big problem. I, I faint at the sight of blood, not just real blood. No, even the blood in my visions, like one drop and I'm on the floor. Like, you have to sedate me before I get to a hospital. Listen, <laughs> okay, I can assure you there's nothing for you to worry about because I already know that um, th those, those fine gentlemen are gonna select a fair and balanced jury and things will proceed smoothly. Except for um, that older gentleman over there who will eventually think that he's judging on a beauty pageant <laughs> that will slow down things a little bit. Dismissed? Oh my god. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Um, just one question. Um, does anyone know where the parking lot C is? Anyone? No? Okay. <laughs>